Hello everyone, welcome to back to another textbook tutorial. In this one I'm going to show you how to transfer music from your PC to your iPhone. So let's go ahead and get started. A few things before we can even delve into this video is first you're going to want to have iTunes installed. If you don't have that installed already, go ahead and just do a quick Google search for iTunes download and then download iTunes through all those links that you googled. Now I'm going to make another video that doesn't have that doesn't require iTunes depending on uh, so that you have more than one option on how to transfer music from your computer but for this one we'll need iTunes. The second thing you'll need is your USB cable that connects from your computer to your iPhone. Go ahead and get all that stuff ready. Plug your USB into your computer but don't connect it to your iPhone just yet. So the first thing that we're going to do is uh, we'll plug in our phone to our cable. So you'll hear a little recognition sound that your computer recognized iPhone and your computer will either one automatically open iTunes but since I have that open already we're just going in and open that up. iTunes should go ahead and recognize your phone immediately so that shouldn't be a big deal as you can see there's an iPhone tab for me right there. So what we're going to do is I'm going to minimize iTunes again and go ahead and navigate to wherever you have your music stored. It could be in your downloads folder, it doesn't matter whatever. For me in particular, I have my music stored in a folder called music. So we're going to go ahead and just select both of these files. Now we can either do that by clicking and dragging and highlighting over them, or we can select one and then holding the control button on your keyboard, select the other. Either way, this will um, let you select as many songs as you want to transfer over into iTunes. So now that, that you have your song selected, let's go ahead and click them and drag them using the left click and you'll hover over the iTunes symbol so that it pops open here. And all you're going to do is release. So as you can see, the songs have down, uh, dropped into my iTunes folder. They're still on my computer yet. They're not quite yet in my iPhone. So let's go ahead and move them over to my iPhone. So. I want this song, so we're going to go ahead and click and drag that one to the iPhone tab right here. And as you can see, it said updating iPhone. That song is now in my iPhone. But some of you may encounter an error right there, an error that says these folders cannot be transferred because iCloud Music sharing is on your uh, is enabled on your device. So let's go ahead and get around that. There's two ways to get around it. Number one, we're going to go ahead and hop over to my phone screen now. Now number one is that you could sign out of your music account. Uh, so what you'd want to do is, let me repeat that step there, is uh, just navigate over to your music app, your Apple Music app, click the upper left screen, and simply sign out if you wish. Or you can go over to settings, you can go to, excuse me, don't go to general, you go to the music tab and then somewhere down here where it says subscribe to iTunes match you'll there should be a little toggle that says iCloud music library you just toggle that off it doesn't appear on my iPhone because I've already turned it off once you um, are done with this video you can go back into your settings and turn it back on all it does is sync the music that you uh, just transferred over to your iCloud so now that you've chosen one of those two ways to get around this error, what you want to do is unplug your phone and then plug it back in. Now you can go ahead and repeat the step where you just click the song from your iTunes library and drop it into your iPhone's folder. So I'm going to go ahead and do that with the second song I moved over so we can repeat the process and you can see. And I'm going to go ahead and drop that here. Now you should see an updating files on iPhone. It's copied. Now that song is on my iPhone. So let's double check. Let's go over to the music app here. And let's go over to my music. As you can see, these two songs were downloaded now. They're now on my iPhone. And it's playing. So let's go ahead and pause that. So there you have it, guys. This is one way to transfer music for, from your PC 
to your iPhone. I'm going to go ahead and cl uh, include the link for another video that I'm going to do of how to transfer music from your PC to your iPhone without using iTunes. So it'll use this app called Errormore. You'll see more in that video. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please comment. I'll help you any way I can. And most of all, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you very much for watching.